Hey guys, what's up? So I'm back with my January favorites. Um, I typically like to narrow this down to my top five favorites for the month. So let's go ahead and just dive on in and see what I picked. Um, for my first one, it is the Paul Mitchell um, Detangler um, Conditioner. I got this thinking that I was getting the leave-in conditioner, um, which I wanted to try for my natural hair. And I got this instead by mistake and it's I think about a $12 price product and I actually really really like this item. It's good as a detangler. It's really rich. However, I have been leaving this in and I love it. Like legit love it. So I, I still want to try the leave-in one which I only seen like I've only seen it at certain places. I don't see the leave-in um, around. Um, as much as I see in the detangler and the regular conditioner, but um, I like this and I don't know the leave-in conditioner if it's no good then this will be you know my best option so this one of the other things that I have been gravitating this month and I really like and is this blush right here. This is the pinup um, palette holiday palette from a couple years ago of course it's, it's from Tarte and it's got a lot of options but the color that I have like really been diving into is this um, neutral shade right here which when I bought this palette and even years after having it I did not I did not you know think that this palette would or this color specifically would not show up on me it is a color that you have to build up but it's got like a rosiness to it and I really really like it I have it on now if you can see it. if you can't I apologize it is a color that probably I couldn't wear in the summer but I'm wearing it now because it's the cooler months and I wanted to get more use out of this palette but I really have been liking this specific color right here so another another item of mine that I have been picking up and liking and that will be my Too Faced um, Gold Chocolate Gold Palette. So this is what it looks like if you haven't seen it already and um, I like the mattes in this palette, I like the shimmers in this palette and the mirror, the smell everything so me like next is my Sonia Kashuk um forgot the name of this brush but I think it was like a I don't know it's um number 20 and it looks like this it's got a you know pretty kind of dense domed head or whatever it's really really soft um i don't know if sonia kashik is changing their blush line or brushes two different colors or whatever but they have put all their brushes on sale so i grabbed this one and this i like to use as um applying a powder to set the cream or the um eyeshadow primer on my eyes so i just use it all over i have you know a lot of eyelid space so I need a big fluffy brush to cover that space a little faster than the small one and this is my last favorite for this month and that is my Mary Kay cream eye color and this is in iced cocoa and there are days where you don't have time to do a full shindig with your eye look in the morning so this is like a color that can just sweep in your eyes and go it um lasts for a long time pigmentation stays there you can put this with the primer or without a primer and it just gives you a little shimmer shimmer in the eyes and that's a video okay so that was my top so, five uh, favorites for the month of january thank you for watching my video i will see you guys in the next one and stay blessed